it'll deploy. Hello, hello. Yeah, wait a minute, do it. Huh? Hello, hello. Can can you hear me? What's going on? What's going on, fellas? Hey there, Mr. Chris. What's the vibes, my brother? Just finished setting uh, setting everything up. Oh no, again. The phone said this and crashed. What's Oh going no. on, man? This keeps crashing. I think it's your phone, man. Okay, let me see. Okay, how how's it going, Mr. Chris? It says waiting for the connection. Yeah, yeah, my 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 thing crashed. My yeah, you know. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah, I hear you, Eduardo. Okay. Ese Franchute. Franchute. In the house. Estoy trabajando con el Larion Web como que abrió acá. Acá estoy. ¿Me ves? <ríe> qué bueno, qué buena. Recas, ¿no? Tú recas, ¿no? Sí, te veo, te veo. Tú me recas, ¿no? ¿Cómo se dice? Te regalo, es eso. Tú me ves. Mais oui. comment ça dit, c'est tu me vois Je te vois, je te vois. C'est ça. Eso. Oui, oui, oui. Merci, merci. Euh, J'ai besoin d'appris le français, mais je, je te... Oui, oui, c'est très bien ou non Ah oui, ouais, ah ouais, c'est bien. Tu te débrouilles bien. Oui, oui, oui. J'aime le français. Je, je parle un peu, j'ai pris l'école, mais je ne... Je ne... I don't speak that often, you see, so I don't... Je vois pas le français. Yeah, I'm going to play the game. I need to practice. ¿Qué parte de Francia vives? En las afueras de París. Cuéntanos, cuéntanos. ¿Cómo es? ¿Qué tal es esa zona? How's that? You like living there? Oh yeah, that's nice. It's the western suburb. suburb. Uh, it's like a, well, it's like a green. There are, there are some forests around. It's a nice place to live. Pretty peaceful. Yeah, yeah, very peaceful. I like green. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Andrés, hermano, ¿cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás, mi bro? Qué bueno que viniste. Estamos con tus guitarras. A ver, espera. A ver, te prende tu micro, Andrés, no te escuchamos. A ver. Ahora sí, ¿me escuchan? Te escuchamos, mi bro, ¿cómo estás? Sí. ¿Cómo están? Y acá también tengo a mi esposa, ella, ella canta conmigo en, en varios proyectos. Ah, uh, perfecto. Hola, hola, ¿cómo estás? Hola. Bienvenida. Hola, buenas. Estamos aquí con Vincent del Franchute, él es un artista de Francia. Ok, mucho gusto. Sí. Encantado. ¿Y ustedes de dónde son? Eh, yo soy de Colombia y India. ¿De la India? Wow. ¿De qué parte de Colombia? Uh, Bogotá. Bogotá. ¿Y, ¿Y qué parte de la India? Mumbai, Bombay. Ah, vale, ok. Claro. Tengo, que, tengo que terminar de hacer el setup mm -hmm. de las cámaras, ¿ya? Pero aquí estamos, aquí estamos. Y mi ¿sabes? mejor amigo era de Pakistán. ¿Sí? Uh -huh. ¿Es especial que hay India? Está al lado. O sea, en el Bay, okay. ¿no? Ajá. Se llama Eddie Hassan. ¿Ah, sí? Ajá, y de Pac, bueno, es de Pakistan, sí, vivo, ojalá. <risa> uh -huh. Vincent, ¿y qué planes hoy día? ¿Vas a salir? Hoy. Yeah, you're going out tonight? Oh, no. Uh, I've got a friend visiting me. Oh, ok, ok. ¿Y there yet? No. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. He's just here. He's just here oh, with okay, me. Okay, okay. That's nice. That's nice. Hey. Amen. It's going. Did you just then bring another bottle of wine? I'm going to get some beers. Hey, Amen. <laughs> hey, that's cool. I'm going to get some beers and get everything up. I got to set the cameras up so Coco's going to be in charge, okay? Look All at right. him. He got a hell of a story. <laughs> <laughs> Now you gotta tell it. <laughs> Andrés, ¿me escuchas? Yeah, sí. Yes. ¿Dónde, ¿Dónde estás, Andrés? ¿Estás en, en, ¿Esa es tu casa? Es el, eh, sí, el, el, el cuarto donde ensay ensayamos y grabamos. Bla, bla, bla. Yeah. ¿Y, ¿Y qué tocas? Eh, va varios géneros. Yo toco batería, bajo guitarra. Eh, en el grupo principal toco batería. 
How do you say drums? Batería. 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 Sí, y uh, sí, pero con, con mi hermano en un grupo, con ellos eh, tocaba vallenato, eh, entonces ahí tocaba el bajo y a veces uh, caja vallenata. Eh, y no sé si saben cuál, la, la caja vallenata es el tambor colombiano, básicamente. Y... Chévere, chévere. Yo toqué con Andrés en Nueva York, pero él tocaba Sí, guitarra, tocaba la guitarra, ¿cierto? Ah, sí. Sí. Ahí estaba tocando guitarra con él. Yo toqué Sí. con él en Nueva York, tocamos con Dylan, eh, fuimos a una sala de ensayo. Sí, fue chévere. Y él nos jaló, él tenía carro, Andrés tenía carro. Y ahorita están, estás en Colombia. Eh, no, en Nueva York también. Sí. Ah, estás en Nueva York. Okay. Sí, yo lo conocí en Nueva York en mis aventuras musicales. Ah, con razón, me parecía raro. No, makes sense. Y Vincent está en Francia, pero es, es tarde, allá es de noche ya, es las En nueve de la noche, sí. New York. No, en Francia. En Francia En Nueva York ya. son las dos o tres, ¿no? No, no, son las la nueve. Son las Nueve, nueve Francia. de la noche, sí. Sí, sí, sí. Pues Andrés, fíjate que hizo un concierto en mayo en París y había un grupo de Colombia Sí. Así. eh, que toca como heavy metal, pero como heavy metal loco, que hacen como, bueno, como covers, pero mezclado, mezclado y muy raro con... con uh, disfraces y cosas esas, hicieron uh, un tour por uh, Europa y pasaron por, por París. Y el mismo día, el día que hizo un concierto, estaban to tocando al, al principio de la noche. Ese grupo que parece, bueno, tiene un poco de, de fama, me imagino, porque ya están eh, por Europa. <risa> colombianos, colombianos. ¿Y cómo se llama tu proyecto, Andrés? Wow. Eh, tengo uno, bueno, te, tengo uno que está, le llamamos Rabia Urbana, que es como, no sé, como música urbana, eh, Ah, sí. como decir al estilo Bad Bunny. Uh, Bien, bien. con ella tengo uno que se llama Sonic Animals, que es como rock, jazz fusion. Vale. Sí. Y, hay, y sí, y hay uno que no, no sé si ya, o sea, no sé si el proyecto sigue porque es, eh, cada rato no, nos reunimos muy poco. Ah, no tiene nombre, o sea, es un proyecto que está. Sí, Bueno, ese es el, ese es el en el que yo toco metal. uh, Ah. pero, eh, pero mola, ¿eh? El nombre no tiene nombre. Eso puede ser un nombre. Buen nombre, ¿ah? ¿eh? Buen nombre. Hay una banda de punk que se llama así, No Use For A Name. Really? Sí, hay una banda que se llama No Use For A Name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Entonces, ¿ustedes tienen un proyecto juntos, Andrés? ¿Tú que tienes un proyecto junto con tu novia? La hermana y chino vi en París ahora, ¿sabes, no? Sí, la hermanita, la hermana, Ajá. ¿no? Sí, sí, Eh. Bueno, Entonces, sí. me decía When tú... you were moved to Paris. Yeah, Bueno. yeah, it was, it was uh, visiting Paris. Yeah, it's a nice city. It's Sí. a nice city. Ay, son... Dime, dime, pero yo le estaba preguntando a Andrés si tú me dijiste que hacen música también juntos, ¿no? Tienen un proyecto. Sí, el de Sonic Animals toco con ella. Eh, el de Metal también es con ella. Y el de el que es como música urbana es con otro, con otro grupo de gente. Ah, Y cuando ya, dices tiene que ser. música urbana, ¿es como reggaetón, hip hop? Es como si, o sea, yo diría Bad Bunny por eso, sería un buen Sí, ejemplo. ajá. Ah, bien, bien. Trap. Mola. Sí, Como sí, sí, esa, como mira, el cantante trap, de trap, reggaetón. otro cantante de trap. Uh -huh. Bar Bunny es trap, ¿no es Sí, cierto? reggaetón, hay Trap. ese merengue también. Mira muchas bandas. De hecho, A mí me parece interesante porque él es una fusión, él es una fusión de varios géneros urbanos. Y hay, Mira, hay... yo no te voy a mentir, yo sí escucho Bad Bunny, sí, sí escucho. Sí he escuchado sus discos, todo. El de Un Verano Sin Ti, yo lo que me da la gana. Después, este, todo, todo desde el comienzo. Ahí conozco toda su carrera. Sí, sí, es bueno. Y sí, Me yo, gusta. yo, yo, yo antes pensaba que era como, antes de en realidad escucharlo, yo pensaba que sería algo como decir, como el reggaetón, que Claro. todos... Es como el reggaetón. Claro. Sí, Pero no, pero en todos los géneros hay cosas buenas y malas, ¿no? Y hay el mejor del género también. Una, una vez yo escuché Bad Bunny más en detalle, 
encontraba a veces que le metía tango, le metía reggaeton. Y ahí fue que me empezó como que, wow, yo, yo he estado como, como siendo el tipo de música que, que juzga y en realidad you know, uno no debería ser así. Y, Por supuesto. y, y me abrió la cabeza cuando en realidad escuché Bad Bunny, me pareció un genio. Pero ustedes han escuchado Mónaco, la canción de Bad Bunny. Por, por ejemplo, esa canción es buena. Uh -huh. Y es Trap. Mónaco es muy buena. Sí, uh -huh. sí, sí. Sí. Hey, there, Mario. What's up? How's it going, my man? We don't hear you. Yeah, actually, today is English conversation. But uh, yeah, we can speak Spanish too. Hey there, Mario. How's it going, Mr. Sydney? But everybody. Talks. Hey, how's it going, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up, my man? How's it going? I was been good. Been real good. Good. Yeah. good. How's it yeah. day? Oh, it's it's been nice, man. Real nice. You know, oh. did um uh, I did uh a uh I finished a rock single yesterday, and I'm working on something today. And I put out a, my uh, another uh, another rock single before I did this one. It's already on Spotify and everything. So it's called Vader. It's a really good song. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw that. I saw that, man. Yeah. That's cool, man. You put a lot of music out. Yeah, I I, I average, man, on, on just a week, probably at least five, six songs. Yeah, I've been doing, I've been doing that for a while now, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Five, songs, like mi mixing or like producing? Like they like Yeah, I, I I do it all, man. I do like beats, I do all my vocals, I'm all vocals producing, uh sound, I do editing like videos, I do it all. I, I'm like my own like record label right now, so I'm independent. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah so, I'm independent all... right so you got your uh, own studio at your house and you do it all. Well well me, I have what you call like band lab. So I, I do everything through there. I do all my mixing, video, like voice editing, vocals, beats. I do it all through there. And I have a distro kit. And so um, they do like a mastering thing on it. And they, they produce your music. They'll put it on like all major platforms. Like, of course, like Spotify, you know, uh, YouTube, Apple Music and all that stuff like that. So like. They do their own thing where they set up, they set it up where they put you actually in the system. Like if you type in my name, like Sydney Moore, it'll come up on YouTube, like all my music and, and it put you on Spotify and all that. So, yeah. Yeah, man. I wanted to uh, like raise the whole band lab thing. So this record is awesome too, but like band lab, that's an amazing tool for like. Collab. Yeah, it is, bro. Especially if, if you're a new person like me, like I started, uh, I've been doing music since I was seven. But I've never been on, really? on the artist side as a single artist, like me, because I, because I grew up as a as a um uh, in bands and stuff like church groups and stuff, choirs and all that, and I got really heavy into music, uh, when I was in my teens. I was a part of like choirs and bands, chamber choir, you know, uh, men's ensemble and stuff. I did some recording and stuff, but it's a different ball game, you know, when you're making the music yourself. Because uh, it's for so long, I was a part of just I go in, drop, you know, some vocals or something like that. But now I'm responsible for doing like, like I said, like the vocals, the mixing, the beats, the sound and all that. So, yeah. Yeah. And band, band lamp is really good for people, especially like me, who you can play around with it and, you know, work on some stuff like that. And and put out a pretty good track. They, they allow you to, it's basically like a little mini studio. They, they allow you to do, go through different beats. You can purchase beats, you can make your own beats, you can dub your voice and do all of it. Yeah. yeah. What's it called? Band Lab. It's called, it's called Band Lab. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's amazing because like actually- A lot of musicians band... work with Band Lab. Yeah, yeah. Like actually the band that I was saying that is like Bad Bunny, one of our uh so I'm in New York and one of the other guys is in uh it's almost in Connecticut. That's like you know, like almost a two hour to three hour drive. Yeah. Uh, so he comes here, we play live every once in a while. But our typical workflow is like we rehearse we you know, we rehearse here, jam things without a metronome, and then once we have an idea, 
we we play and record the thing to a metronome and then those become like little lego pieces like right like they're like loops that you can just move around yep. and then from there the rest is like everybody on their own home builds the other lego pieces and that's how we we do the the, the music uh without band lab that would be impossible so it's and and, and with distro kit it just distributes the music so yeah. when you sign up for different plans and stuff like that you know, you can get the basic plan or you can get the other uh, cer certain plans where you can literally watch and track all your music on YouTube and stuff like that. But like if you just get a basic plan, you know, they'll put your music on different platforms and stuff like that, like Spotify, like I said, Apple Music, mm -hmm. Spotify, YouTube, uh, even Pandora, all different type of stuff. So, yeah. That's cool. Uh, hey, Daniel Holloway in the house. What's up? What's up? What's up, man? Thank you for coming. He's back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> on. What's up? What's new? Oh, not too much, man. Just chilling. Well, Just what? Chill. Just chilling. Okay, okay. No plans for the night? Huh? No plans for the night. Oh, tonight? No, I'm going to just be... Uh, it's, it's Sunday. You know. I'm going right? to just be trying to record some more stuff, you know, or learn some more stuff. And what kind of music do you record or do or play? Um, right now I got a YouTube channel, but it's like just like creating beats and tracks and stuff for other uh, artists, you know. At the, what at kind the, of music? It's it's basically R and B rap, you know. R and B or rap, okay. okay. You know, it's just, it's just, the uh, beats I create is just for anybody, you know. Mm -hmm. Doesn't matter what genre of music they're in. It's just yeah. something that you know. I felt, you know, because I'm a heavy player. And it was a surprise to me that actually getting into this, I was having so much fun. So it was like, you know. And do you on. create some hip hop, hip hop too? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Um, s send me your uh, your site or your link. Definitely. I would Definitely be interested. Will. Okay. Uh, I work with some uh, beat beat makers around the world, and I'm always right. interested in uh, listening to mm. to beats. Okay, no problem. Definitely will. Yeah. Franchute is the man, eh? Franchute is, yeah, I heard his music. It's like reggae, rap, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, any... I have no frontier, really. But yeah, uh, mainly reggae and, and hip-hop. But uh, but yeah, also some reggaeton, also some Afrobeat, <laughs> dance, reggaeton. Shata, um, yeah, yeah. reggaeton. Good. Hey, let's, yeah, I mean... Afrobeat, right? Yeah, yeah. Now you know. I if I've got the vibe on any kind of uh, yeah, I, uh, rhythm, I, I sing upon. I don't. I don't work any too. frontier. <laughs> that works. That's what it is. I do that all little, starts of music to it. That little spark that goes on inside of somebody, you know, when they hear something, especially if it's original, you know, they could just actually come out with it and just incorporate that to what they can do you know so it's it's a beautiful yeah. thing that people could actually do that you know yeah i mean yes yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of layers to it too you know like oh yeah no you know i, I used to say that uh, we will probably never create anything really new but what is possible nowadays is just to yeah. pick up a bit in every music that have been done before and and some mix can be quite uh, innovating or interesting exactly. but, you know the best best rock has been done the best uh, uh, well any kind of music I, I think it has already been been played but it's so but much we can mix all of this. doing now like you push a button and there's itself it's right yeah yeah, but that's good and bad. That's good and bad. Yeah, sure. I said it's easy. Like it also enables you to do a lot of different crazy stuff and that's true. Um, yeah. like, incorporate different kind of sounds and all. But yeah, then it, it like it's easy to to start playing it, but then to come up with something good, you need yeah. to be like more creative and stuff, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sometimes though, the old school, uh, the old school approach to uh, producing. It's still real. I mean, there's still something about it that that sometimes even having all the facilities of you know like say say for mixing and producing a plugin that just saves stuff. Sometimes actually, I have a good example from a track I'm working on uh, that 
Yeah, that were, that were producing brand. Let me just unplug this cable so I can show it on the camera. So I'm, I'm using this guitar pedal. Uh, let me see. Let me just, uh, you know what? Actually, let me move the camera. Uh, uh, actually, it's great. I, can, I cannot move the camera. Uh, but so, so, so the, this is like a guitar pedal with a real spring inside. Wow. So I'm sending uh, with a reamper, I'm sending the signal out uh, through a send. And because it's a real spring in the song, I smack the hell out of this thing, and you actually hear the <laughs> like you hear the mix of suddenly, like, yeah, yeah, like you hear the song go like, <laughs> and when you smack it, you hear, <laughs> yeah, you hear that, <laughs> yeah, like, bring it, vibrate, it in. yeah, right, right, yeah, uh, yeah, this is it's an awesome pedal. I mean, it sounds terrible, but in a beautiful way. Uh, like, <laughs> yeah, it's called the Endless Summer. It's like a really gritty sounding spring reverb so it's like a spring yeah. reverb that should not probably be created but that's why i love it <laughs> mm -hmm. it's, uh, yeah nice uh yeah and, but yeah like I, I think that stuff is imitable with plugins but it's not the same where's your wine where's your wine <laughs> <at? laughs> <laughs> closed, closed, don't worry. Cheers, hello. Cheers. <laughs> and there you go. <laughs> I get I got coke. Coach. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> there is water is the best. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Huge water fan. Yeah. Water over here. <laughs> Water on the rocks. <laughs> <laughs> sober for three and a half years, you know, so it been works. Been sober for three and a half years? Yep, sure have. Yes, I've been sober for 48 hours. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. I believe you. <laughs> it's not I that easy. You. I, was, you know, I, was just like, I was just like that, too. <laughs> Go to sleep, wake up, start it again. Dude, it was so it's hard to fall asleep. Like last night, when I sleep at like 2 a.m. Because, you know, I was sober. So I couldn't sleep. It's hard. I'll fall asleep, but later at 3 a.m. Your mind's racing. Exactly. It's too many thoughts. Too many. Mm -hmm. Hey, guys, I'm interested in listening to the music you're playing. Yes, we are. Yeah. yeah. I would like to hear. Let's share. Let's share. Let's share a link on the chat room and I'll play it. We're yeah, that'd be cool, man. Oh, yeah, that'd be cool. Put me a link on the chat room with your song and I'll play it. We can all hear it. Uh, let's oh, see. Let, let me see how let's you do it. Try. Let's give it a try. Okay, let me see. see. How let's do it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, here we go. No. I could share it in the chat, huh? Yeah, I didn't know you can do that. That's a chat room myself, here. Yeah, of course. <laughs> idea is to keep this signal open and then have people come and listen and they can write in the chat room and they can request songs and all, right? I will get up the uh, Okay. Uh, don't, don't you have like a YouTube? Oh, I did. Yeah, it, like if you, if you do have Spotify, you it, it might play the whole song if you have it like purchase. It might play the whole song. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I did that like two days ago. Oh, Vader, yeah. 